sight this is. Old Rocky Top in Knoxville, Neyland Stadium, home of the Volunteers. And now the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Jennings and the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Watch the screen, watch the screen. Watch the screen, down. Blue 14. They'll bring him down to the 38-yard line. That's the kind of play calling and execution I like to see. Being one-dimensional on first down can really stack the odds against you. It's better to mix it up. He gets rid of this one. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Swings it out there incomplete. There's one the quarterback would like to rewind because he has a wide open receiver and he just misfires. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 38. Five wide. And he's got it. And they make the stop at the 45. It'll be short of the first after the completion. Well, good effort by the defense to make sure they got him before he got to the marker. Robertson takes it to 15, and down he goes at the 23. The Bulldogs have got a guy at quarterback that is a true leader. We found that out this week talking to him. We sure did, Brad. It was interesting this week and as you and I prepared for this game, finding out that he called a players-only meeting without any of the coaches just to get this team focused and let them understand what it takes to go on the road and to win this kind of game. And when you have that kind of leadership, you get a real chance to be able to go on the road and win. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Gets it out quickly. And he's tackled at about the 33-yard line. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Brought down at the 41-yard line. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's taken down around the 37-yard line. That was just a case of one lineman dominating another and making the play. From their own 37-yard line, third down. Delivers to the halfback on the screen. They'll knock him down for a loss. Doesn't look like he's going to have much time to get rid of this punt. They'll bring him down at the 35. Flags are down, and this one might be on the offense. Holding. Receiving team. 42 yards. Nice yardage on the run back. Return for a gain of 14 yards. First and 10. Ball on their own 35. Tackle made right around the 36 yard line. Gets six yards after taking the handoff on the draw play. That makes it third and three. Third, 
third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. From the 38-yard line, first down. Steps out around the 35-yard line. That's a game of key on the play. That'll make it second and seven. And he's immediately tackled. That's a game of seven. First down. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 28. Offense lines up in a five-wide set in a defense, anticipating pass here. Got a man. Watch out here. He's tackled right around the 20. Eight yards. That makes it second and two. He's taken down at the 14. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 14. Quick shot, the defender tips it away. Brad, I'd let the quarterback put the ball there where it could have been caught. The receiver's got to do a better job of fighting for the football. When that ball is up in the air and it's between a defender and a receiver, I think the receiver's got to show more effort and a willingness to fight for the football. The safety just knocked that ball away from him. Slings it. He's pushed out of bounds at about the five-yard line. Here's play number 10 on the drive. That'll make it third and one. Touchdown, Volunteers. He really plowed his way into the end zone there. Great-looking touchdown. Once you get inside the 10-yard line, this halfback is automatic. And he tacks on the extra point. A 10-play, 65-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. Tennessee gets set to kick this one away. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Quick throw to the tight end. Tackle at the 39-yard line. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz. And the quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. They go to the back, and he's hit immediately in the backfield. From their own 37-yard line, second down. And they push him out at the 41. He's hit and taken down. That's a gain of 12 on the play. First down. Quick throw, and he shoved out of bounds at about the 37-yard line. 
That'll make it second and inches. It's just me and you. It's just me and you. 34 is the mic. 34 is the mic. He's coming. Check in. Check in. Big opening. Makes it out to about the 29. We got a flag down on the field. Might have been offsides. Offside. Defense. The defense doesn't seem to have an answer right now. They might need to change up some of their schemes. First down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 29-yard line. They come out on an empty backfield. Deep ball laying it out there. And a huge touchdown play. This guy just continues to impress me. Every time I watch this team play, he seems to come up with big plays. It was a textbook post route, and the pass was right on target. We'll be tied with the extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. It was a seven-play, 75-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. We get a tie game at 7-7. Tackle made at the 17-yard line. Every drive's important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. They come out in a five-wide set. Out of bounds at the 20. That's good for a game of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. It's second and seven. Ball on the 20. Let's go! Throws it in a hurry. He gets hit out of bounds at the 25-yard line. That'll bring up third and two. in the open. They'll bring him down around the 30-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 30-yard line. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. Caught, and this is going to be a first down. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. He's going left. You never know what will happen when the ball ricochets like that. Good effort by the defender. That makes it second and From their own 43-yard line, it's second down. Delayed handoff, and he's not going to get back to the line. That is a loss of two yards. That brings us third and 12. Ready! Throws complete, he's got space to work. And they make the stop around the 41-yard line. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. From the 41-yard line, first down. Tackled after a decent pickup. That makes it second and six. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Get on the ball. Get on the ball. Get on the ball. Here we go. We played one. We're even at seven in this one. Tied up as we head into quarter number two. Let's go! Throws, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. Well, they'll line it up again on third down. Two for two so far on this drive. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. 
they get nice yardage on that run. Gain of six on the play. That makes it fourth and inches. It's up. And it's good. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. He's to the 20. Oh, man, he took him down hard. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. That's a great tackle at the 29. You can hit the tackle at the 29 yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Gets out to about the 31. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's how we do, D. That's how we do. They don't want none of this. First down. Check, check out. They go right back to him, and this time they get him in the backfield. But you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. Ball on their own 37. Caught, and he's out of bounds. That's a loss. Get it to the tight end, but it falls to the ground. That pass didn't look exactly right when it left his hand. Sometimes you don't get a great grip on the ball, and it comes out a little wobbly. Jimmy, back to return it. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. Brought down at the 22. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Tennessee is up a field goal. Inside give, and he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. Two yards. That makes it second and eight. From their own 24-yard line, second down. They got to him before he could get back to the line. Loss of one yard on the play. That'll make it third and nine. And he's tackled at the 32-yard line. Red on the tackle at the 32-yard line. Fourth down. Robertson will be the return man. Robertson fields it at the 27. He's tackled at the 34-yard line. George has gotten the play out of their quarterback, and you expect that that was going to happen. But, I mean, what is happening here? Somebody else is going to have to come to the forefront, or this thing's going to be over. If you would have told me before the game that this quarterback would have played like this to the first quarter and a half or so, I would have thought this team would have been leading this game. But you're right. Something has got to happen where the, his teammates, the rest of this group, They've got to raise their game if they want to have any chance of winning this game. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun, five wide receivers. He's into the open field. He's at the 40. Gains his way to the 33-yard line. That's a game of 24 on the play. First down. 
They'll line up with five wide receivers. He's under pressure. Throws to the tight end, and that ball's incomplete. Here's a case of a quarterback so eager to make a play that he failed to see the danger of that attempt and nearly gave the ball away. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 33. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. And he's taken down at about the 25-yard line. Not a bad little play there. Yeah, this is a nice job by the quarterback reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice game. Brought down at the 17. That makes it first and 10. They'll spread the field with five wide. Gets it. He's in space. The five. And down he goes. Just outside the goal line. Number 35 makes the tackle at the one yard line. That makes it first and goal. Touchdown, Bulldogs. When you're that close to the end zone, it's always a smart play to find your blockers and follow them into the end zone. He makes the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Tackle made at about the 29-yard line. That makes it second and six. It's second and six. Ball on their own 29. to the receiver. He's taken down at the 49-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 49. Tackle at the 41 yard line. That makes it second and two. And they hit him in the backfield. Call it a loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up third and four. They're about four yards away here on third down. Gets it out quickly. Tackle at the 21. This guy's got the combination of smarts and reliability that makes a receiver really dangerous. No wonder he's looked to on third down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 21-yard line. Good open field tackle. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Let's go! And they bring him. 
second down for a sack on the play. It's the ninth play of the drive. The Volunteers are going to call their second timeout. He's going to try and scramble. There's a fumble. Picks up the loose ball. Once the ball hits the ground, it's a matter of luck and will. And on that play, it was the defensive end who crowded for his side. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. He gets rid of this one. From their own 16-yard line, second down. Georgia holds a four-point lead. Zips it to the back, and they get him in the backfield for a loss. to the 20. Makes it out to about the 33. The Bulldogs will use their first time out of the half. From their own 33-yard line. First down. Caught and big hit there to stop it. Georgia is going to have to use their second time out of the half. They come out in a five-wide set. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. Disco Raver! Disco Raver! And they got him. The Volunteers using their third and final timeout. Oh, excellent punt. at the 29-yard line. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. He makes it to the 32-yard line. That's good for a game of three. They'll bring him down at about the 39-yard line. We played a half. Georgia in front, 14-10. Boy, I hope the second half's as good as the first. Just about set to start the third quarter in a tight one. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They're ready to begin another drive. Georgia is up by four. He fights forward to about the 26. Swift takes it up the middle. And they got him for a loss. Setting up blockers, or running backs got it on the screen, and they push him out at the 28-yard line. Jenning is back to receive. And this one is a beauty. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. I love 
love the toughness here by this quarterback of sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield, only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. He fights forward to about the 36. Third down. Third and 10 coming up. Ball on the 36-yard line. And they make the stop around the 41-yard line. about four yards away here on second down they spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers fires quickly and he's got his man huge gain and that sets him up nicely with a first and goal i think this defense right now doesn't realize that it's going to be a run or a pass and that's the perfect time to be able to call play action this defense is on its heels. They're guessing with the offense. That time they guess wrong, and the result is a big play for the offense. It's first down. So inside the five with a first and goal. Offense lines up in a five wide set in the defense, anticipating pass here. Fires quickly, and they got it. Touchdown. I like how the quarterback, the offensive line, and the receivers made a concerted effort to get into the end zone. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Stenzi Maglia ready to kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, this is a very competitive game. Just when you think one team has gained the advantage or the momentum, the other team comes fighting back, and it's going back and forth. This is almost like a basketball game. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense, as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And now he's got room to run. He's to the 40. Makes it to the 47. That makes it first and 10. Pick. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. From their own 47-yard line, it's second down. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. He's got it with room to run. And he's tackled right around the 36-yard line. Gain of 17 on the play. First down. The offense going to try to open this field up, coming out in a five-wide set. And the defense counters with their dime look. Caught open field. He's out of bounds around the 21 yard line. Gain of 15 yards. First down. Hey, here we go. Rose to the receiver. Got it for the touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. It was a textbook post route, and the pass was right on target. Uh, 
And he tacks on the extra point. So a five-play, 75-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, how about the guys up front? The offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. George's coaches just got to be happy. I'd love to coach a kid like this. Oh, I think these coaches love to coach a guy like this, and another great performance by him individually and for this offense. This offense threw the ball extremely well on their last drive, and they ended up with a touchdown. And it was a really nice drive, too, Brad. The quarterback got into a nice rhythm and did a good job of picking apart the defense. Nice run there. Called a gain of five yards. That brings up second and five. From their own 30-yard line, second down. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. That's a gain of four on the play. That'll make it third and one. He lets it go. Throws complete. He's got room to work. He goes out of bounds at about the 49. First and ten. Ball on the 49-yard line. Got a man complete, and he's hit hard. That's good for a game of five yards. That brings up second and five. Taken down at about the 35. That makes it first and 10. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 35. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. And a quick throw. He's at the 20. This isn't even the best example, but I'm going to tell you something. This young man is really getting better at running his routes, which is a truly underrated quality these days. From the 19 yard line. First down. There he goes. Taken down as he works the left for a nice game. Here's the eighth play of the series. Keeper. No game. That'll bring up third and two. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Larry, Larry. Mike 17, Mike 17. Go, go. Go. Makes the grab and out of bounds. And this is the 10th play of the drive. Touchdown, Volunteers! Stop mistreating Uncle Lou! And that's his second touchdown of the day. When they need a play, you usually know who's going to get the ball. Excellent run to put these guys up on top. Trying to go up by three. They'll kick the extra point. He makes the PAT. A 10-play, 74-yard drive. And the result, seven points. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. So our score... 24-21.
The last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. Steps out of bounds at the 29. Gain of four yards. That makes it second and six. Brought down at the 28. That is a loss of one yard on the play. That makes it 37. Third and seven coming up here. Ball in the 28. Trying to set up a little screen, gets it to his tailback. He's knocked out of bounds. Right around the 32-yard line. You listen what the general tell you now. Jennings back deep to return. And he has it on the corner. Jennings fields it at the 26. They'll bring him down to the 39-yard line. And here comes the offense again. They'll try to make it two touchdowns and two possessions. Yeah, this offensive coordinator's got to be feeling so good about the execution that he's seeing from his quarterback and his wide receiver. Because, again, they put so much time into trying to put a plan together, and to be able to see that actually come into play makes you feel pretty good as a play caller. That brings up second and one. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Tennessee is up by three. He's level at the 40. That's a game of 11 in the play. That'll move the chains for another Tennessee. First down. Fires it out. Tackle around the 28 yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 28 yard line. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And he's sacked. He has one job on passing situations. Get to the quarterback. And he did that job very, very well on that play. Defense looking for another sack in this second down and long situation. He's scrambling. And down he goes at the 33-yard line. Well, the third quarter's in the books, and you have to wonder if either defense is going to make a stop in the fourth. 24-21, Tennessee. Well, this final few minutes is going to determine this one. Tight ball game. Action set to start here in the fourth quarter. And they've got the dime package in there to try and deal with this five-receiver one. Wow, a big stop there early in the fourth quarter. And the way this game has been played and how tight it's been, every defensive stop will be huge. They're going to try a long field goal here. It's up. And he nails the long field goal. Maglia has the ball set and he looks ready to kick this one deep. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, here we are early in the fourth quarter in a very, very tight ball game. And every possession is going to count from here on out. He's taken down at the 38. He goes downtown. He's tackled at the four. This is a great pitch and catch combination, and they hook up here for a big time game. Down at the 
one-yard line. That's a game of three on the That brings up second and goal. And he throws it away. It's third and goal from the one. And can they take the lead, or will the defense come up big? And we're all tied up. You definitely want the football in his hands near the end zone, and he showed you why right there. Trying to take the lead. Here's the extra point, and he hits the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Makes a catch and he's got nowhere to go. From their own 26-yard line, it's second down. With the pass incomplete. Brad, I don't know about you, but it looked to me that they just miscommunicated. It looked like the wide receiver was going in one direction and the quarterback was throwing it another direction. They definitely need to get on the same page. They go with a screen here, and the halfback's got it. Tackle made at the 35-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 35. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. They come out in an empty backfield. Slings it, and they make the stop at the 45. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He fights forward to about the 43. That's a great tackle. The 37 yard line. They're about four yards away here on second down. And they get nice yardage on that run. It's the ninth play of the drive. Quick pass, and he hits him hard at the 32. No gain on the play. That brings up second and nine. From the 32-yard line, second down. He fights forward to about the 30. That'll bring up third and eight. This is the 11th play of this drive. They go to the ground and he stops short. That is a loss of one yard. That'll bring up fourth and nine. It's fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. It has the distance. And he just drilled it from long range. Listen what the general tell you now. Tennessee, the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. 
And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. Thompson on the tackle. stage of this game, they probably have to go to the air. Pass right, running back's got it. The screen is good for four. Just under three to go in regulation. Kicks up, and he splits the uprights. They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Tennessee's given them all they can handle today, and they're still not done. Yeah, let's remember, they were a heavy underdog coming into this game, and here they are, under three minutes to go, with the football, a chance to put a drive together, and who knows, maybe they can take the lead. Offense lines up in a five-wide set, and defense anticipating pass here. Got his man, can't tack on any yardage. Second so it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Ready! 59! Oh. 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 Nice run there. So he got a few yards on that carry. If you can continue to pick up small chunks of yards like that, you can really start to wear a defense down. Jumped out of bounds right around the 36 yard line. That'll bring up second and 11. From their own 36 yard line. Second down. He makes it out to maybe the 39 yard line. Under pressure. On the throw, incomplete pass. Just under two minutes in the game. Under heavy pressure. Strike to his receiver, no good. This is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Five wide. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. The Volunteers will use their first time out of the half. We've got a second and nine here. Ball on the 38. Gains his way to the 29-yard line. Tennessee is going to have to use their second time out of the half. Might have a chance. Nice run to the outside. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
bitch. That makes it second and six. It's second and six. Ball on the 19 yard line. That's a gain of 14 yards on the play. That makes it first and goal. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. He takes a knee. Who am Georgia playing? Woo!